Hey everyone, it's Flackfire. It's time for episode two of Skin Deep, where I look at a few of the skins in Battlefield 1 and I talk about their historical roots. Now, before I begin, you might have noticed a name change for the series. It turns out that unbeknownst to me, another community member began a similar series just before I started this one. And I know from experience, this can be a frustrating situation for both parties, and I'd really like it to be a positive experience for him. So please check out the video game historian with the link in the video description. With that said, let's dig into the history behind a few more skins in Battlefield 1. Today we're talking the Breakthrough Müller skin for the MP18, the Gladiator skin for the Shosha, the Bersaleri skin for the Shea Regatti, the Le Mans Homme skin for the Shogren Inertial Shotgun, and the Fleur de Mor skin for the Saint-Germont tank. The Breakthrough Müller Distinguished skin for the MP18 is a literal translation of Durchbruch Müller, the nickname given to Georg Bruchmüller, a German colonel in World War I credited with the development of the Creeping Barrage and known for his detailed planning of artillery strikes. His tactics played a major role in the German successes during the Kaiserschlacht in 1918, though they weren't enough to turn the tide of the war. The Gladiator Distinguished skin for the Shosha isn't named after Russell Crowe or Roman Bloodsport. It's actually named after one of the factories tasked with producing the weapon. Ironically, Gladiator was also largely responsible for the terrible reputation that persists for the Shosha. The company manufactured the problem-plagued 30-06 versions of the Shosha for the American Expeditionary Force. The Bersaleri Distinguished skin for the Shea Regatti is named after the highly mobile Italian infantry unit of the same name. The Bersaleri played an important role on the Italian front, known for their marksmanship skills and ability to strike quickly, similar to the famed Arditi. An interesting footnote, Benito Mussolini, the Italian dictator in World War II, actually served as a member of the Bersaleri in the First World War. The Le Mort Homme legendary skin for the Shogren inertial shotgun is named after some of the most hollowed ground near Verdun. The heights of Le Mort Homme were the site of bitter fighting in 1916, and it claimed the lives of tens of thousands of soldiers. That hill lies north of Verdun proper. Lastly, the Fleur de Mort distinguished skin for the saint chamon tank has a special place in my mind since it is likely named after the last surviving saint chamon tank in existence, which bears the same name. Typically, the vehicle is located at the Musée de Blond in France, but is touring armored shows in Europe, in full running order nonetheless. The video footage here is from this year's Tank Fest and is courtesy of the Bovington Tank Museum. You can check out more videos from them with the link in the video description. So, what are your thoughts on these skins? Which skin should I cover next? Tell me in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like, share our websites like Facebook and Twitter, and be sure to subscribe. To take your Battlefield 1 game to the next level, check out the Battlefield 1 Ultimate Utility app with a link in the video description. And as always, thanks for watching.